This is an Alan Bradley 2080-LC50-24QWB with an analog input module 2085 IF4 and an analog output module 2085-OF4. We have the emitter here to measure the current that's coming out from the analog output channel 0 on the analog output module 4 million 8 million 12 16 and 20 The problem we are facing here is that when the emitter is disconnected or the load is removed from the analog output channel, the PUC will automatically kill it. Let's try it. Disconnecting the emitter from the analog output channel. Reading zero. Now let's reconnect it to the analog output channel. It's still reading zero. Nothing coming out from the analog output channel. This is the solution from Rockwell Automation Knowledge Base Center. So we need to write this value 3848 to this tab to reset the analog output channel. For the tag we have underscore IO underscore XX underscore CO underscore zero zero with the lower X here is the slot number of the analog output module. For this setup, we have analog output module is on slot number 2, 0 for the PUC, 1 is for the analog input module, and 2 is for the analog output module. So this is what we need to be in the logic. We have reset and move instruction. If reset bit is true, this value will be moved to this tag. If reset bit is false, 0 will be moved to this tag. Now let's test it. When the reset bit is true, the analog output channel will start working again and the emitter will start reading again. True. Meter reading again. 16, 20, 4, 8, 12, 16, and 20 milliamps. That will be it for this video. Thank you for watching. If this video is helpful and you like the content of my channel, please like, share, and subscribe.
Accept thanks at the lower right corner. It's a great way to show your support to my channel. Thank you.